Hey, Jeff here with Digital Trends. This is the HTC Evo 4G LTE. Uh, we took a look at this a few weeks ago when it was unveiled by Sprint. Uh, so this is basically kind of like an HTC One phone, um, except it's been branded for Sprint. Uh, this one's kind of tethered down, so you can't see much, but there's a little kickstand on the back there. Uh, typical Sprint, uh, you know, red and black. Um, that's actually not typical Sprint, that's more Verizon, but uh, some different coloring there. Very thin, it's got its own dedicated camera button. Kind of follows in the Evo line. Uh, it does manipulate my hand around here. This does have a larger 4.7 inch screen, so it's a lot like the One X. Everything. And as you can see, it does have Google Wallet built in. I don't know if it'll be activated here. Probably not. But you can see there's an activation screen there. Um, Sprint supports Google Wallet, so that's very cool. This has got all your typical HTC. This runs Android 4.0 with HTC Sense 4.0 UI over it, so it's got a lot of little visual flares that regular Android doesn't have. Um, Here's a look at some of the apps that are installed. It comes with Dropbox. You get uh, some free Dropbox support built in. I think it's 25 gigabytes. I could be wrong on that. And then uh, not too many apps. Sprint is uh, Sprint is pretty good about not shoving on too many useless apps. Like all HTC Sense phones, you can uh, customize the skin and the whole look of it, just like that. You can also add, they have so many widgets. I could get rid of, uh, get rid of that, customize the whole screen. I could add a weather widget. And it's kind of easy as that. A little better than even a typical Android. So you've got that. It's got the camera features. So you can record video. And I'm just going to block, kind of one handed here. So I'm going to block that off. Looks like you can only do one shot there. I'm not sure if it has the imaging chip. I'll write that in the article, figure out that. But overall, very good phone. Um, this is going to kind of compete for the top spot on phones for Sprint when it comes out later this year. Uh, hopefully very soon it'll be coming out, actually. It has Beats audio support throughout the whole device. Uh, very good. It'll kind of be uh, between this and the uh, Galaxy S3 uh, if that comes to Sprint. So this is the HTC Evo 4G LTE.